Who among us did not like to climb trees and did not dream of climbing a palm tree and picking a banana or coconut from there? This episode will show you 10 of the most unusual trees on the planet and where to find them. Baobab, an amazing tree of the Malvasia family from the genus Adansonia. It is also called the Adansonia palmata. The plant reaches 25 meters in height and 11 meters in width. The trunk of the tree has a pot bellied shape and holds up to 120 liters of water. This allows them to survive the winter drought. Some baobabs take the shape of a bottle, a skull, or even a teapot. People even live in especially large trunks, and in Western Australia, there is a baobab prison where the police left criminals for a while. Most of the year, these trees remain without leaves. The baobab is a national symbol of the island of Madagascar. It is also painted on the coats of arms of Senegal and the Central African Republic. There are about nine species of this tree in the world. Six of them grow in Madagascar, the rest on the Arabian Peninsula, on the territory of mainland Africa in Australia. Almost any part of Adansonia has a use. A strong fiber is made from their bark, effective medicines and soap are obtained from bark ash. Young leaves are added to salads, dry ones are used as spices. Glue is prepared from flower pollen. The fresh pulp of the trunks is very nutritious and rich in vitamins C and B. Oil for frying is also obtained from it. A raw seed of the fruit is edible and a coffee substitute is brewed from fried. Women from East Africa wash their hair with baobab fruit powder, and people paint their faces with red juice from its roots. Due to the absence of annual rings, it's impossible to determine the age of old trees. Scientists say that these trees can live up to 5,000 years. Tule tree, Mexico this tree is a specimen of the Mexican Texorium, growing in the square next to the church of the city of Santa Maria de Tule, the state of Oaxaca. The Tule tree is a distinctive for its size, its trunk is the largest in the world, 58 meters in girth and the height is 35 meters. The exact age of the plants is unknown, but scientists believe that the tree is more than 1500 years old. Tule stands on an ancient sacred place of the Indians and has an unofficial nickname of Tree of Life due to the fact that a Images of various animals can be seen in the bizarre curves of its trunk. In 2001, it was included in the UNESCO World Heritage List. Dragon Tree, Canary Islands. The dragon tree grows in Tenerife and is a living symbol of the Canary Islands. It is also called the Tenerife tree or Dragonet. It got its name due to the resin, which has a juicy red color, the so called dragon's blood. The locals consider it sacred, and since ancient times they have been using it for various ailments. The dragon is famous for its unusual shape, resembling a huge umbrella covered with greenery, hence another name – umbrella tree. These trees grow very slowly, mainly on rocks. It's also impossible to determine their exact age because they do not have annual layers. Adult specimens have a length of up to 20 meters and a trunk width of up to 4 meters. Flowering begins at the age of 8 years and in some individuals flowers appear only after 25 years. Then, berries are formed that taste like cherries. In Ica de los Venus in Tenerife, there is a unique dragon consisting of many small trunks. Presumably, the age ranges from 660 to 1500 years. These trees can also be found in the Madeira archipelago, the Kingdom of Morocco and Mexico. Tree of Life, Bahrain a very unusual ancient tree grows on the highest point of the barren desert of Bahrain for more than 400 years. It is considered the loneliest in the world. How it could survive without water is a mystery of nature. It's believed that its roots stretched for several tens of meters to the aquifers. This tree is a symbol of life because it grows where it seemed that nothing could survive. That is why the tree of life has the appropriate name. Locals believe that it was at this place that the Garden of Eden was located. Wollemi Pine, Australia. The Wollemi Pine is a unique and valuable plant listed in the Red Book. Belongs to the genus Coniferous family Aracaraceae. Grows in Australia. These woody plants were widespread during the Jurassic period. They are the same age as dinosaurs and hence its second name is the dinosaur tree. When scientists discovered a live tree in Altham near Sydney in 1994, they were amazed. At that time, there were less than a hundred pines left in nature, and their exact location was carefully hidden for the purpose of protection. Botanists have made every effort to preserve the endangered species. In 2006, the mass sale of Wollemi seedings began about 5,000 Australian dollars a piece. Now they can be seen in various botanical gardens. 
In Russia, they grow in the botanical garden named after Nikolai Vasilevich Tsitsin. The ancient plant reaches up to 40 meters in height, the thickness of the trunk is 1 meter, and depending on their origin, their branches are able to grow both sideways and vertically. General Sherman, the USA General Sherman is one of the tallest trees on our planet. It was named in 1879 in honor of Civil War General William Tecumseh Sherman. This giant reaches almost 84 meters in height and weighs about 1900 tons. The volume of the trunk is about 1500 cubic meters and the age is presumably 2500 years. The tree is located in Sequoia National Park, California. It is truly a masterpiece of nature and the greatest living organism on Earth. Rainbow Eucalyptus Rainbow Eucalyptus is a surprisingly strange and beautiful plant. It differs from other types of eucalyptus in its coloring. In the process of maturation, the bright green bark acquires blue, orange and burgundy shades. The trunk of mature trees shimmers with all the colors of the rainbow and the coloring is constantly changing. A grove of rainbow eucalyptus trees resembles an artist's workshop. You can meet this type of eucalyptus in the Philippine Islands, New Guinea, Indonesia, the Malaysian Archipelago and New Britain. The tree prefers a humid climate with an abundance of precipitation. It is mainly found in most forests up to an altitude of 1800 meters above sea level. In the fastest growing species of eucalyptus, it reaches a height of 75 meters and the diameter of the trunk is only almost 2.5 meters. The, the bark of this tropical plant is constantly billing off and used for paper production. Furniture is made of wood and leaves. The peculiarity of rainbow eucalyptus is that it's not susceptible to various diseases and therefore it does not need treatment with chemicals. Bottle trees of Socotra Island The bottle tree got its name from the fact that it looks like a pot-bellied bottle. In height, it can reach 15 meters, in diameter, up to 3 meters. It grows in eastern Australia in one of the driest places on Earth and brings a lot of benefits. Its trunk is a source of drinking water, and in the upper part of the trunk, in special cavities, there are accumulations of a sweet nectar. The leaves are also used during the drought as a livestock feed. Seeds are eaten raw and fried, and the roots of young trees are eaten as root crops. They are very juicy. Oak Chapel, France There is an interesting oak chapel in the village of Alleville Belfast, France. It's considered the oldest in France and has been classified as a historical monument since 1932. The height of the oak is 18 meters and the circumference reaches 16 meters. In 1669, two chapels were built in the hollow of the tree, the Chapel of Old Lady of Peace and the Chapel of the Hermit. Spiral staircase around the trunk provides access to them. The oak is a place of pilgrimage on August 15th, the ascension of the Virgin Mary. Puya Raymonda The Puya Raymonda tree of the bromeliad family growth in the Bolivian and Peruvian ants. Its peculiarity is a large inflorescence with a diameter of 2.5 meters and a height of about 10 meters, consisting of 8,000 whitish green flowers. When they fade, they acquire a purple hue. The tree is well adapted to growth in adverse conditions. In stony soils, at an altitude of more than 3,000 meters, where it's usually cold, begins to bloom only after reaching in about 100 years of life and then dies. The species is considered endangered and is protected at the state level in Peru, where there are about 800,000 of them left.